So possibly the most controversial thing we've heard about the iPhone 7 that every reviewer owner and anyone on the internet is talking about is obviously the lack of the headphone jack. Now personally I think it's a little bit strange, I understand they say it's for saving space inside and for uh, improving the waterproofness which both of those don't really make too much sense to me but whatever I'm not an Apple engineer. Uh, either way the, that's one of the biggest problems also for a phone that costs somewhere between six and seven hundred dollars uh, having to pay an extra forty dollars for an adapter just to have functionality that you had in the last model or possibly paying even more money because you'll lose the adapter that you know you need for your uh, you know nice fancy headphones and um, that have a 3.5 mil jack on them it's just a little bit strange but anyway regardless that is probably the biggest issue or at least the biggest issue people are talking about with the iPhone 7 and the second one is that even though they've had battery upgrades the battery still doesn't seem to last more than a day for the majority of users who use it for more than about five minutes with screen on time so hopefully uh, these two things are on the table below me which cost less than £50 in the UK at the time of filming and um, will hopefully solve both of those issues uh, give or take or very least show you that there are some options out there other than the $160 uh, Apple AirPod headphones that you'll A likely forget to charge, B likely lose and C look a little bit strange with the, these little things that are sticking out your ear. Um, but I guess if you don't mind looking strange these will probably be just fine for you as well so um yeah let's take a look speaking of not being all that stylish or at the very least uh you know just generally not that good looking accessories in your ears these Aki uh, secure fit earbuds are about 20 pounds about 19.99 at the time of filming anyway um and surprisingly these are obviously bluetooth headphones they have a built-in battery uh they claim to last about seven hours and that seems to be roughly right which is actually similar to the earpods and obviously the earpods you put them in the charging case and you get an extra uh, up to 24 hours total um charge but obviously these ones are quite easy to charge with uh, a cable in the bottom of them. Um, these are obviously attached by a cable which means if one of them falls out of your or you just want to have one you know around your neck or something while you're speaking to someone it's actually quite comfortable it's quite uh, you know, nice and when your ears don't hurt uh, especially with this sort of rubber support it does mean that they're overall quite comfortable they don't fall out your ears in fact um, I tried a quite amusing test yesterday of slamming my head around and they still didn't fall out so that was quite cool. Um, overall even though they are quite big they're reasonably light in the ear so they're not that uh, you know uncomfortable even on long-term use which is quite nice and while they do look stupid they do have a microphone built in as well so if you did want to have some phone calls that's still awesome they work on uh, with Bluetooth so obviously if you want to use them on Android or iOS uh, or Windows phone I believe as well uh, then you can use them on anything and obviously they are considerably considerably cheaper than AirPods uh, or AirPods rather so uh, yeah if you want these you can pick them up on Amazon in the link below um, and yeah it just uh, just to make it clear I'm not suggesting you definitely pick up this specific model there are plenty of even more expensive or cheaper Bluetooth headphones uh, this is just the one that Oki sent to me to sort of do this video basically um, so if you want to check them out the actual sound quality in these is really good I don't know whether it's just specifically because they're so big they can have some nice decent side drivers and, that, and stuff like that but the audio quality from them is actually really impressive so if you want some decent a uh, decent pair of headphones for 20 quid uh, that are bluetooth and work with your iphone 7 or 7 plus then do check these out so or the link to uh, amazon where you can pick up anything else now the second problem i mentioned was battery life this Oki battery bank is 20,000 milliamp hours, which means you can charge, as far as I'm aware, with the, uh, I guess, leaked battery specs. Um, you can charge the iPhone 7 at 10 full times with this battery bank, and you can charge the iPhone 7 Plus around about seven full times. Uh, obviously, the extra charge as well from the initial charge of the phone. Uh, so that is obviously pretty awesome. You can actually charge two devices at the same time, and you can use quick charging with these as well. So if you just want to fill the battery up as quick as you possibly can, you can do that which is awesome uh, and means that if you're in a pinch you need to you know very quickly charge up your uh, iPhone 7 you can do it uh, 10 full times if you've got the 7 or 8 7 or 8 times with the iPhone uh, 7 plus and one of the really cool things about this one specifically is that it actually has a lightning connector in if you want to charge the battery bank so you don't even need to bring a micro USB cable and a lightning connector cable you can just bring your lightning cable plug in uh, the lightning cable to the wall with uh, the battery bank and then when you need to charge the phone just take that same cable plug it into one of the charging ports 
and charge your phone up with it and off you go. You can also use it as a uh, flashlight if you uh, so want to. If I can get it to work, you just hold the uh, power button down and you can enjoy some lens flares there. But uh, either way, it is still quite cool. Obviously, uh, being able to charge both two devices at the same time, meaning you could charge your AirPods and your phone or whatever other wireless headphones you have, um, or just you know charge two phones at the same time. That's obviously very awesome. And with a quick charge, it means that it's quite uh, fast to do as well. So that's obviously very nice. And at the time of filming, this costs $26.99. So, uh, you know, if you do want to pick up uh, these two things, obviously you can do that in the Amazon link down below and it's something like a third of the price of, uh, you know, both uh, of the new AirPods alone and you still get to charge your phone possibly up to 10 times, so that's pretty cool. Now the point of this video isn't necessarily to say that you need to pick up these two specific things and that's the only thing you can buy on the markets. That's definitely not the case. I just wanted to make it clear that one, uh, there are battery banks that will definitely help you, especially with a lightning connector, which is awesome. And there are plenty of other options for wireless headphones that are much, much, much cheaper. So if you are planning on getting an iPhone 7 or 7 Plus, don't worry too much about not having a headphone jack as there are some pretty awesome headphones even if they look a bit weird and you know have uh, not the best battery life in the world type thing um, it's still very awesome there are still plenty of other options for you and obviously if you do want to help me out it'd be awesome if you could use the Amazon affiliate links in the description down below as it does genuinely help me out anyway I guess that's kind of it if you enjoyed the video and you want to see more of these kind of reasonably funny if not anything else kind of videos then feel free to subscribe hit the like button and let me know uh, in the comments down below if you didn't like the video though feel free to dislike but let me know why in the comments down below so that I can prove for next time if you prefer that I just stick to reviewing PC hardware and that sort of thing then feel free just let me know in the comments down below and uh, yeah other than that feel free to follow me on Facebook and Twitter I do generally post quite regularly there and um, so it'd be nice to uh, you know make sure you know when the videos are coming out and other than that uh, yeah I guess that's kind of it as I said check out some of the other videos we've got plenty um, actually, if you're here just because you found this sort of video as an iPhone video, then feel free to check out the ASUS uh, UX305CA. It's an Ultrabook, it's actually very similar to a MacBook Air type thing, it's a similar sort of hardware, um, but it's considerably cheaper uh, and actually quite nice. So feel free to check that out, I'll leave a card up above probably over that way um, for you to check that out. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching, we'll see you in the next video.